Hey everyone, it's been a while since I made a video, so um, I'm just gonna make an update here. And uh, I've been living with um, indigenous Sami people in uh, Sweden um, as a sort of reindeer uh, herder and some other things. So uh, that's why I really haven't had time for much else here. And uh, there's not the best like uh, internet connection here either. But uh, yeah, the thing is that I sort of did this already like a year ago. And uh, then I went really far north in Sweden and I lived with some of the Sami people there. But uh, at that time I didn't document really much anything because I really wanted to get away from technology. But uh, this time I'm gonna document some things and uh, I have actually opened a blog where I make some blog posts about uh, life here. So uh, this blog is called The Narrow Way. Uh, the narrow, uh, uh, it's the narrow and then uh, slash uh, the way on uh, blogspot.com and I'm, I'm just gonna link it in the description of this video uh, so you can check that out and uh, on this blog and I think also here on YouTube I'm gonna upload some uh, interviews with some of these people because uh, indigenous rights are really kind of a hot topic right now, I think. So uh, that's why I want to give these people a voice as well. Um, and, and really just like anywhere in the world, these people have been uh, discriminated against for a long time and they, they still are, I think. And they also are uh, victims of uh, climate change. They have felt this for a long time. So uh, this is sort of what I wanted to uh, investigate. And uh, I, I'm going to upload some interviews about this. Uh, I think this is really important. So uh, I should upload one of the interviews uh, very soon. So feel free to share this uh, with anyone you know if you think this is important as well and uh, if you are someone that uh, you know works with this maybe you know some uh, indigenous people in, in uh, America or something or maybe you are one of them you know then uh, maybe you can uh, contact me you can send me a message and uh, we could maybe uh, talk about something uh, make a project uh, or, or something uh, right, and um, I think this is also about um, you know finding a, a lifestyle which is more um, harmonious uh, to nature uh, and, and to really live in a way that feels uh, right. It feels that you're not really uh, exploiting anyone or anything. You're you're really uh, with a community of, of nice people that really are in tune with um, with nature and uh, the spiritual and, and everything. And I think that's really where we have to go uh, in the future if we want to survive. Um, yeah, I'm here in uh, in Dalarna in, in Sweden. Uh, there's like, like a lot of rivers here and a lot of mountains. It's kind of like uh, Alaska, I think, uh, in terms of climate. Um, so it's kind of interesting that uh, Sami people, when they go uh, to the mountains or whatever, they actually don't bring any water because you can actually just drink all the water here. It's so clean. And there's like water everywhere, basically. So uh, it's just a really, really nice place. Uh, besides all the mosquitoes, but um, yeah, and uh, the thing is that uh, it really is possible to 
to do this, uh, to just, uh, you know, go be a reindeer uh, herder or something like it's, it's really, you just have to do it. So like, you know, you could leave your office job uh, today and you could just go somewhere and uh, be a reindeer herder or uh, grow your own food or something like it's, it's totally possible. And there are communities of people that do this and uh, I think among the younger generations like myself, um, we are really tired of uh, the modern capitalist society and we want to find something that is more uh, genuine and um, just feels more right and uh, it's totally possible. Uh, we are making a transition towards a, a better earth and uh, yeah, so uh, that's what I'm gonna do and I hope that I find uh, like-minded people online so yeah check out my uh, blog and uh, upcoming interviews and stuff and I see you next time bye